Hey everyone, in this video we will explore the usage metrics for a report in the Power BI service. So essentially we'll just look at uh, the usage metrics and get an overview of that and then we'll explore the report a bit further. Uh, let's start. So I'm already logged into the Power BI service and I'm on my learn to Excel workspace. And I'll open my report, which is just a Power BI report I've uploaded. And uh, I'll click on this uh, three dots over here and I'll click on usage metrics and when I click on that it will show the usage metrics uh, for the report which essentially uh, shows us how the report has been viewed and how many views have been for the report on any given date and then you've got uh, unique viewers per day total viewers so we'll just go through this so we've got the distribution method which is essentially whether it is on sharing or whether the user has it has the report has been shared with the user or he's got access to the workspace and you can click here to get more information around this uh, you can look at the platform so it could be mobile or web uh, you could have a report page so it will give you the option how if so if there are two pages which pages were accessed and you can have a look at that as well and uh, then you you can uh, pretty much that so that's pretty much all there is on here but what you can do is you can create a you can save a copy of this report so so let's say if i save a copy of this report and say usage matrix my report and hit save and now if i if i go to my workspaces learn to excel and you can see the i can see the usage matrix report and now if i open it see it's it's uh, given me the option and i can see the filters as well the filters which have been applied so i can uncheck these filters here and it will all of a sudden show more data for us. And if I go on here and if I click on edit as an option, you can see I can see the underlying fields and the tables which are being used by this report as well. So I can look at the underlying data model and what I could probably do is I could uh, click on. Uh, so it doesn't give me the download to uh, download option, which is interesting. I was sort of after that. But I can still look at the, so I can look at the date dimension, I can look at the name and the other tables that it is accessing over here. And then I could probably create my own visuals or modify some of these. So I could probably select this and convert it into a tabular view. So uh, it's an interesting one. Uh, so in this video, what we've essentially covered is the usage met metrics for a report, which tells us how the report is being used. It's a pretty good indicator of how the users are using it and how often a certain report gets used or whether a report is getting used at all or not. And then we've learned how to access the underlying report, uh, which is generated and is shown as part of the usage metrics. I hope you find this video useful and thanks for watching this video. Uh, please do subscribe to my channel and like my videos if you enjoy what I'm doing. Do give me a shout out if you want me to cover any specific topics or want me to build another playlist. Uh, cheers, bye.